work is just absolutely stunning. You don't see me for ages and then all of a sudden I'm back. I don't know if that's a crease, a line or tears of excitement. Um, we are in sunny Yorkshire and we are staying in a little cottage called Angel Cottage. So I have my Yarndell outfit on. I wonder if I can show you. So this is the, um, oh crumbs, the little top that I made in the, in the summer. So I have this on today and I've layered it over a white blouse and um, I have handmade socks on. So perhaps I'll show you, maybe get Laura to um, yeah, do a full shot, maybe. Um, so it's called Angel Cottage, so there's lots of things that are angel themed and it's very red. But it's cute, it is really cute. So I'll turn you around to show you the hall. So we're in the hall now, which is really cute. So my case and my shoes, my boots, I've got stairs that go up there, it's a nice mirror, I've just brushed my hair, a really nice coat rack, so I'll put my coat on there, my backpack and my litmus cow, which is by Green Blue Fern Yarn, sorry, Blue Fern Yarn. So this is the kit that I bought. Um, I've got lots of compliments um, today. Yeah, and it was a rainbow, rainbow inspired kit. I absolutely love it, absolutely love it. So let's take you into the front room. It's really cozy, I'll put the lights on. Oh, is that better? <laughs> so it's really, yeah, really cozy. Beautiful window, lots of nice lovely plants. Really lovely. And TV is huge. We've got a good DVD collection. Well, I'm assuming there's loads of DVDs there, so we might even have a look. There's a log burning fire. The artwork on the walls is really nice. Really, really beautiful. Really beautiful. I love all the old um, Victorian Edwardian buildings. Look at that. It's not beautiful. And there's one on the other side. And these will be the um, barges at Skipton. Look at this beautiful fern. Isn't that magnificent? Really beautiful. And all the homemade hearts. Right, so we go out into the hall and then we go round to the dining room. Then we come into the dining room, which is really beautiful. It's so light and airy in here. Look at that couch, that looks fabulous. <laughs> decent sized table and then this looks out onto a little courtyard so we could go and um, sit out there I just like the the attention to detail all like the plants and everything really lovely really lovely there's a downstairs toilet you know what that is, so I don't have to show you that. Um, yeah, all the comforts of home. So, nice fire, mirror, and another TV and a cabinet. And then in here, this is like a little gem. Look at this kitchen, oh, it's so cute. I came in here thinking, oh my word, oh, I love this, wouldn't take me that long to um, clean this. <laughs> I'm thinking, oh, what, are you a bit sad? Yeah. That's next door. It's really cute. So we've got everything we need. Washing machine, not like I can see myself doing any washing. Um, oh, dishwasher, I haven't seen that. Oh, kettle, I'm gonna have a cup of tea in a minute. Toaster, oven. Oh, of course, we've been to Marks and Spencer's, so we have a few treats. We have 
bottle of wine. I think my daughter bought that from her stash. So I'm have a banana for tomorrow. Oh, and then we have a treat tonight. I absolutely adore these yum yum donuts. I think my daughter's got a chocolate cupcake. And of course, if you go to pit Mark Spencer's, you have to get Percy Pigs. Right, I'll take you back upstairs. It's really light and really airy in here. Very clean, it's beautiful. Oh, I hadn't noticed this. They've left us a bottle of wine. How nice is that? So I'm going to go up the stairs. So Laura's in the other room, if you can hear her. There are the stairs. And then we have my bedroom. I don't think we've divvied up the um, bedrooms yet. So this, yeah, two single beds, but it can be put together evidently for um, a double bed. So really cute, really cute. Nice little wardrobe. Oh, and another TV. Yeah, really cute. And then outside is the patio area, and then it looks like, I don't know, can I open this? Yeah, and it looks like you can park your car at the back. It looks like a communal area where you can hang your washing out and the children can play, which is lovely, really lovely. It's really quiet here, really quiet. I'm going to go along the hall. There is a shower room. Yeah, you know what a shower room looks like. And then there is the main bathroom, which again, beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Look at that bath. Really nice. Yep. Yeah. And through here, and then there's another bedroom. I think my daughter might be having it. Yes, my daughter's having this one. Yes, yeah, loads of storage space. Loads of storage space. And it's really warm as well, which is really nice. Is there a, oh yes, there's a TV in here as well. Oh, and check out that little fireplace in the corner. So cute, so cute. And then we come out of here. I get my bearings, it's huge in here. Right, we are. And this is the last bedroom. Oh, look at this. Isn't this lovely? Really, really lovely. This is, yeah, Jeanette was gonna be in one of these bedrooms, bless her. But she's not well. I hope, Jeanette, that you're feeling a bit better today. Oh, it's another TV. I don't watch TV. Uh, we've got one in our, our bedroom, but it's nice when, if you're not well. So there we are. That's a tour of our little home for the next couple of days. We're here tomorrow, um, Sunday, so we can go back to Yarndale. Oh, look at me, I'm so tired. Um, and then we're here Monday. We're having a little retreat. So we're just going to craft, I think, and maybe find somewhere for afternoon tea. And then we are up early and back home on Tuesday morning. My daughter's got to work. Um, yeah, oh, I do excuse my face. Um, Max, the dad of the Jack Russells, he started sort of waking up from five o'clock, half past five onwards. And I think he's got to that age where he needs to go and do a wee. We all know what that means. So I'm going to have to start getting up with him. Maybe my face won't look like this. I don't know. Maybe I'll come back on and I'll show you our spoils for today. We had a plan and we were going to um, just have a look around, just do a recce. And then if there was anything we saw, I'll take a note of it and go back. Laura was the one that scuppered the plan. She bought the first game of yarn and that was it. We were one here, one there. But hopefully she'll come on and let us have a look. But she might not want to have a face on, which is absolutely fine. Once I've taken my makeup off, you wouldn't want to see that. Come back and see you later. 
Right, I just thought I'd show you my outfit. Um, what have I got on? I've got a long sleeve t-shirt on underneath, a layered piece, I think that's what they say. Then I have a um, shirt, this is from the other week, from the white stuff. And then my hand knits, and this is the jumper that I knitted in the, in the summer. The King Carl, was it Creative Linen? Linendale, I think. Linendale, Linendale, what else says. Yeah, so I have my skinny jeans on, and then <laughs> her hand made socks, and these are from the yarn that I jump. You can see them. Well, oh, these are so lovely and so warm. I should do like a little sock dance. <laughs> so, that is my outfit for today. <laughs>